good morning friends so today we will discuss uh, one more problem on projection of uh, lines let us see the problem the line ab admm long has its end a on xy line and is inclined to hp at 30 degree and inclined to vp at 45 degree draw front and top views of line and determine their lengths also measure perpendicular distance of end b from both hp and vp so this is the given problem so this problem this projection of uh, lines belong line is inclined to both hp and vp and is saying end a on xy line so we need to determine at what distance the end b is located uh, from xy line from both hp and vp so we need to determine along with uh, we need to draw front and top view and also we need to determine their lengths so here uh, ab is a true length is given and uh, and a on x y line and is saying inclined to hp at 30 degree and inclined uh, to vp at 45 degree so how to solve this problem the first thing is we need to do the sheet setup just go to just move the cursor on sheet and right click do the go to sheet setup here background and here select a4 size sheet uh, remove show background option save as default okay and uh, we need to pick the sheet so this is the first step you need to do before solving any problem using the solid edge or v20 software so now so how do you solve this problem now how do you solve uh, this problem so let us uh, draw it to a line so i'll take a line and uh, thickness is 0.13 or else you take uh, you draw a thin line so i'm constructing a line this is the line i'm constructing horizontal uh, thin line now indicate a vphp and uh, x y line go to text times new ROM. font size is keep 3.5 so just type this is x this is a y and uh, say vp say hp so now just refresh and uh, select the uh, uh, x hold the left button and move it here just i'll select the y hold the left button and i'll move somewhere here similarly i'll select vp hold the left button and drag somewhere here say so i'll keep this is my vertical plane and i'll keep uh, this is my horizontal plane so now let us construct uh, this drawing so now line a b atm and long as its nda is saying on xy line means on xy line and is inclined to hp at 30 degrees see if any dimensions are given with respect to hp show above xy line so i'll select a line and uh, uh, i'll construct i'll select a thin line say let us take the uh, thickness of this line is 0.1 pm and this is my start point say this is my a point a and uh, length is given 80 mm which is already mentioned the true length and the inclination with respect to hp is given 30 just type 30 and press it and uh, and right click now if only you can measure the length and angle let us see the angle how do you go to angle between or go to drop down box select angle between select this inclined line and horizontal line and just move the cursor like this to get the inclination so that is 30 degree inclination is given with respect to hp and how to measure uh, the true length ab so go to smart dimensions and uh, select this line see this is uh, line of length is adm so now go to text go to text this is my a dash so you need to show a boy here this is my a dash this is my a dash this is my b1 dash b1 b1 dash just i'll arrange the terms properly so this is my a dash this is my b1 dash let us construct a locus of uh, b1 dash line or reference line and here this is my reference line just I'll extend the line like this. This is my reference line. And uh, a dash, this is my a locus line. Okay. So now just type here locus of uh, 
Virash. <laughs> I go to text and uh, type somewhere here. Let us say local soft. Soft B1 dash. Local soft B1 dash, and this is local soft gate. This horizontal line itself is local soft gate. Local soft A dash. <coughs> Similarly, so let us move on to inclination with respect to VP is 45 degree and the length is 80 mm. Again, A is placed on X, Y line. That is given the condition. So go to line, select the endpoint of uh, A dash. The in, uh, length is 80, just type length is 80 mm. And angle, it should be in uh, counterclockwise. So we need to give negative sign. So angle is uh, minus 45 degree. I found you can cross check the angle and length. So go to angle between, measure this and this. It is 45 degree fine road. And similarly, go to small dimension, measure this distance. It is 80, fine. So now let us draw the locus. So for, just go to text, just go to text. I go to text. So this is my A and this is my B1, pro length. A B1 is pro length in the top view. This is my A. And uh, this is my B1. No brother locus line, locus line of B1. So select the end point, just draw a line like this. The end point of this line, and if only you can extend the line like this, just for your reference. Now go to text, go to text. See this uh, the locus of A exactly below the x y line. Uh, x y line itself the locus of A dash as well as locus of A. Locus of uh, this is a locus of A, and uh, Locus of A and this is locus of B1. Locus of B1. So I constructed our locus line. So now I know A dash and B1 dash. So how to find the upper end length in the top view? Just drop the line till the locus of uh, A, then cut the arc. That's the procedure we need to follow. So select the line from B1 dash, just draw the line till locus of A, then go to arc by center, put A is the center, and this will be the radius, you cut the arc like this. Now, this intersection point will be the B. This intersection point, I will call it as B. So this is uh, my B. Now select a line of thickness 0 0.50 because it is visible apparent length I am getting in the top V. Join B and uh, A. Similarly, repeat the same procedure. Select a line. So now from B1, I will draw a thicker line till the locus of A dash, then cut the arc, you will get the apparent length in the current view. So select a line, select end point of uh, B1, move the line till the XY line, till locus of A dash, and go to arc by center, take uh, A dash, uh, take A dash is the center, and this will be the radius, cut the arc like this. So now this intersection point, this point I will call it as uh, uh, B dash. This intersection point I will call it as B dash. This is my B dash. So now draw the front view, upper end length in the front view. Select a line, it is visible. Choose 0.50 mm will be the thickness. Select the B dash and join B dash A dash. So you will get the. Um, 
front view and is the top view, upper end front view and upper end uh, top view. Just measure that uh, uh, measure their lens, which is given in the problem. What is not dimension? Measure what is a dash b dash. A dash b dash. I am getting 56.57. Similarly, measure what is a b. A b. I am getting 69.28. And also, he has to measure uh, also measure the perpendicular distance of. Uh, uh, and B from both VP and HP from year to year. What is N B and from year to year? What is N B? You need to measure. So just go to small dimensions. Measure the distance between here to here. From year to year is is given 40, and 